Hopefully we get some voice acting right here, because I need to close the door. And of course, there's no voice acting. Uh, you know, the other spent day after day in the labyrinth training constantly. I'm so glad I didn't have to train in the labyrinth constantly. No sooner had they gotten their strength back, did they receive a message from old Class 7. New Class 7's own way of departure then came with the following dawn. <clears throat> Get myself some Mediterranean pasta salad. It is delicioso. And it is confirmed $6.99. A pound. Oh, we got new clothing. Y'all look, uh, different. Wow, these feel great. They're so easy to move around in. Your guys' new outfits look great on you, too. Thank you. I am surprised how well they suit me. Yes, I didn't expect such modern clothing from an ancient village of witches. Some of us bring back magazines from the outside world from time to time. It is enough for us to keep track of the latest fashions. I once tried dressing a little more hip, as the young people say, but Emma said it did not suit me. Guess, uh, guess she can be surprisingly stubborn about that kind of thing. I suppose it does behoove her as the village elder to put forth an appearance of grace and dignity. Well, I wish I could have seen that. I bet you were really cute. Anyway, it seems, uh, it seems like we can finally get started. Yes, beginning today, we can take our first steps toward finding our instructor. Why don't we just start with the previous day? For real? What kind of lead did you guys find? At this point, it's only a tentative possibility based on grandmother's abilities and our own investigations. But if it goes well, we may be able to pin down the Black Workshop's location. Alright, get out of here. There is no way. That's excellent news. Yeah, it definitely seems like the place uh, they'd be keeping him. But how exactly are we supposed to find it? I understand your concern. In the 800 years since the witches and gnomes split, we haven't found even a trace of their headquarters. They may have mechanisms in place to evade our senses, or perhaps they may even be hiding in a different dimensional space. If their lair truly exists somewhere within the Empire, however, that narrows our search considerably. The Great Twilight has caused unprecedented disruption in the spirit veins. There are several spots across Erebonia where the local mana has been stirred into a frenzy. We call those spots singularities. So far as I can discern, there are seven such spots of notable size. The members of Old Class 7 have already been dispatched to check on the ones in the Croizen, Nortia, and Nord. There are two more in Sutherland and La Mer, and the final two have yet uh, we have yet to locate. Our plan is uh, to drive a spirit stake into each of these singularities in order to stabilize them. Once we can use the spirit veins again, any blank spots on our map will stand out clear as day. Gee, I wonder where the other two are. Interesting. It's almost like a magical version of active sonar. Clever. Instead of searching for the workshop itself, you'd be singling out places your senses can't reach. The theory is solid enough, at least. You two really followed all that? I mean, right. Sounds good. Remember, there are no guarantees this will actually lead us to the workshop. And unless we find those uh, last two singularities, our odds of success aren't great. Still, if there's even the smallest possibility, uh, we'll bet everything on it. Whatever it takes, we'll find Reen and bring him home. Everyone, you're right. You're totally right. Let's do this. Thank you for all your help. With all of us working together, we should have it done in no time. 
You can leave the singularities in uh, in the the east and north to us. Russ is up to you, new class seven. Right. Hey, parallels twists. Pikachu is so cute. <laughs> I'm not a Pikachu person. I'm more of a Munchlax person when it comes to second best Pokemon that there absolutely is. Uh, we'll be heading out now, Rosalia. I'm glad to hear it. You've all worked exceptionally hard to recover your lost strength. Considering the trials you've overcome so far, I have every confidence you'll succeed in your mission. Thank you. Instructor Randy, will you be coming with us? Yeah, for at least a little bit. I want some answers too. I figure I might be able to track down Teo Todd if I stick with you guys. That makes sense. We should be able to pick up some information as we travel. I recommend you start by looking for the Sutherland Singularity. Do you have the tools I gave you? Yep. Uh, it's these stake things, right? Once we find a singular singularity, we drive these in to stabilize them, right? That pendulum looks a lot like the pendant Emma gave Instructor Reen. Made of materials that react to large concentrations of mana. It also acts as the key linking this village to the outside world. Head through the woods on the outskirts of town. The teleportation stone there should take you to the Isthmia Great Forest. Ah, but before you go, I have a message from some of the villagers. Ooh. Uh, Lise? Liesi? Lise? Uh, the innkeeper. Uh, not two ends though, just one end. Uh, and Gandalf, uh, the blacksmith from Middle Earth. Uh, Euclase too. They all said they have something for you. Euclase is at the center of the village, while Lise and Gandalf can be found in their respective establishments. Uh, I wonder, I wonder what it is they want to give us. Uh, I feel bad. They've all done so much for us already. Hey, no harm in accepting a little extra hospitality if they want to give it. You need that Pikachu emote? I, uh... Alright, great. Costumes. I understand. Um, I actually do have a Pikachu emote. Um... Smiggy was was uh, asking me to create an emote for him, and I was like, a Pika uh, this Pikachu emote idea would be interesting. So I was developing one, but it wasn't coming up to my quality standards, so I wasn't able to actually make him an emote. But I do have something. Um, it's just not good. Good enough for me, anyways. Oh, well, look who stopped by. Yep, Rose passed your message on to us. You said you had something you wished to give us, correct? Yeah, I mean, it's nothing special, really. But if you're going to be traveling around, uh, you're bound to get a lot more chances to cook for yourselves. So I thought you might like this. Oh. A recipe book? Ooh, it looks like the one Instructor Reen used. Glad you like it. I hope you get some good use out of it. Here, take these two. It's the tavern's recommended recipe and the ingredients to go along with it. Suck a foo. I bought that from you. This is quite generous. Are you sure you want to give us this much? Don't be shy, my dear. Go ahead and take it. it. Doesn't matter who you are, you still need to keep up your strength. Whatever else might happen, you've got to at least try to take in some regular meals. Or take some... Take in... Anyways. Uh, this is all so very sweet of you, Lise. Uh, thanks so much. Yeah, you're a lifesaver. About making food. Recipe and ingredients. You can try food. Recipants. Recipants. Unique dishes. Herb and peculiar. Yep, yep, great. Looks like nothing has changed. more of a puff person since you're a puff main I, I I like Jigglypuff but uh herbalist home but uh, when it comes to my favorite Pokemon did, did anyone see that oh something wigging out over there 
Could just be my eyes. They'd be playing tricks on me. Um, my favorite Pokemon is actually not Munchlax. Can you believe it? Uh, what do you think you're doing? Bringing home an injured monster. Don't tell me you want to keep it as a pet. But he's hurt. I couldn't leave him all alone. There's no way he would have survived. Very well. I'll teach you a taming spell to make him your familiar, but promise me you'll take proper care of him. I promise. Girl and her pet monster, huh? There's something you don't see every day. People in this village are probably more used to monsters than we are. I want to shop. Oh. Hey. No. Oh, thanks. I don't want to read any of this dialogue. I just want to, you know, shop. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, wow. You material is like... Oh, Brave Seeds restore three now? Yikes. That's pretty crazy. Uh, make a little bit of money here. Alright. So, I'm gonna buy at least five battle scopes. Because we gotta. We're on episode 27 of Pokemon Indigo League. Pokemon Indigo League. Squirtle? Squirtle is not, although Squirtle Squad Squirtle is pretty cool. Alright. Only that Squirtle, though. Sorry to call you over a uh, over at a time like this. I know you must be busy. Not at all, it's fine. We heard, we heard you had something for us. Right, seeing as you're here, I thought you could use this rare quartz. Here you go. Hey, I need that. Wow, thank you. It ain't nothing special. Oh, and sorry, but you won't be able to use these in your ornaments immediately. Why is that? This kind of thing happens a lot with battle ornaments. Is it because our Arcus 2 units were upgraded to a new version? That's about the size of it. Oh right, the same thing happened with the Enigmas. I see, I remember hearing about a similar issue with the original Arcus units. Basically, you're going to need to upgrade your slots if you want to make use of rare quartz. The way I see it, the best way to learn is by doing. Take these and try it out. Wow, this is a lot. You're really pulling out all the stops to help us, huh? Gotta take care of our important guests, right? It's only natural. Now upgrade slots. Max EP. Okay. We are correct. Okay, so I guess we won't give this to Altina because she has Detector. Hmm. Rinse, freeze, petrify, and faint. These are actually not the worst things I've ever seen. I think I'll be using Randy for very much longer, to be honest here. Wow, we have a, a lot more Sepith than I thought we would. Oh, I spent way more than I meant to, I think. Maybe not. Maybe not. But maybe. Uh, you got your slots all upgraded. Yes, thanks to the Sepith you gave us. Hey, it's nothing. Uh, there's one other new function to this version you'll be wanting to know about. Hold on to your hats. There's no more sub-master quartz restrictions. From now on, when setting up a master quartz in the sub-slot, you can have them set for as many people at once as you want. Oh my goodness. That is impressive. 
But using Yuna's Scold Quartz as an example, with this new version, Altina, myself, and Instructor Randy can all simultaneously use it as a Submaster Quartz. That's right, you sure pick things up quick. Oh wow, I hadn't heard about that. Seems like it's gonna come in handy. Yeah, for sure. We better set it up uh, now so we don't forget about it. Use it however you see fit. Let me know if you want uh, any new weapon upgrades or equipment before you go. And I'll synthesize. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, you can use U material to customize your weapons and quartz. And exchange, yep, great, got it. Uh -huh. Like your master quartz, the master quartz can blah blah blah. This, this changes a lot. Like, a lot, lot, lot. This is huge. Uh, only... Ability 1 activates, stats only rise slightly. Alright, so it seems like, other than just like general nerfs all around, seems like uh, things are not much different. Okay. I don't know if they're gonna give us this stuff back, but you you have stuff that we're going to be giving to other people. For some reason, he just has no HP. Give you defense. I guess we'll give you speed breaker. Man, right, that's looking a little better here. Oh. I think everybody going oops serious is probably for the best here. Uh who did I give? Okay, I gave you analyze. The I'm not covering up too much there. Uh, it gives 50% accuracy. Uh, that's a little crazy. Make sure they mess with my tactics. Put Randy in the front. like synthesize and all that crazy stuff. Okay, this is super cheap. Might as well. couple of those. I don't remember who Recuria is on. But uh, I am mostly... Oh, okay, it's on you. Training is so bad. Um, 
He has too many wind quartz. Use Akafu. Alright, we're gonna remove that. Go like that. We still have a break. I guess we're gonna give to you. We'll give you this defense. Little sneeze coming on. Um, oh yeah, I, I didn't finish. Uh, my favorite Pokemon is actually Ditto. Bet you never saw that one coming, huh? Hey, uh, Euclid. Oh, sorry, are you busy? Not at all, I've been waiting for you, actually. It would seem you are fishing rather than just waiting, actually. Uh, I can do both, can't I? Plus, it's related to what I wanted to talk to you about. I've been spending a lot of time outside the village lately collecting intel on the rest of the world and all that. I ended up diving pretty deep into the world of fishing. In fact, I'm actually a registered member of the Imperial Fishing Club now. The Imperial Fishing Club, that's a professional fishing organization. They're affiliated with the Lake Lord Company, as I recall. All right, some of Instructor Reen's acquaintances are members too. The way I hear it, they're fierce rivals with Crossbell's Fisherman's Guild. And how is all of this relevant to us? Well, the Ashen Chevalier's fishing prowess has been subject to some rumors around the club. Word is that you students of his aren't too shabby yourselves. Well, with one L, uh, I guess we did get pretty decent at it. But I hear you guys lost all your fishing equipment and notes. Uh, I'll be frank, as a passionate practitioner of the angling arts, that's something I just can't turn a blind eye to. So you lucky lot are in for a treat. This looks a lot like fish, uh, the fishing rod instructor Reen used. Are you sure we can have this? Hey, things are going to get rocky for you going forward. Sometimes you just need to cast a line or two and let the world stand still a bit. You can buy more gear or trade, uh, trade in any fish you catch over at the Lim uh, Limerick General Store. They'll give you special rewards for catching, dif uh, catching different types of fish, too. One for each milestone. Thank you. We'll be sure to check it out. One more thing. I don't know if it's because of the curse per se, but the ecosystem's gotten a bit fishy lately, if you, you'll pardon my language. Uh, you can see the weirdest outlines in the water sometimes. Might be worth keeping an eye out for. Thanks for letting us know. We'll be sure to keep it in mind. Alright, fishing. Yep. Okay. Purchase enough. Well, I think we're done here. All right, we should move on to the woods next. Uh, the ones we passed through to reach the St. Graal Labyrinth, correct? Never would have expected the Isthmia Great Forest to have a hidden side to it like this. Anyway, let's head outside the village. Okay, let's go. I was about to say, like, are you going to give me a fishing spot over here? What? <laughs> I could reel in a big haul here. All right, looks like it's the same as Cold Steel 3. Casting. Mana Dryad is not pleased with my my choice of favorite Fight Pokemon. Received. Heavy tension on the line. Oh my gosh, you just showed me this. They changed up some sound effects. It's a big one. Kasagi. Well, uh, Casting. do uh, three fishings. Fight here. received. Oops. Mission failed. I believe that does not use my bait. Yep. Casting. Fight received. Heavy tension on the line. No, I've never learned what happens when you break your line. Oh, this guy's uh, a little tricksy. This is the hardest fish I've ever had to to 
I got one. It's a fish, I guess. Here I go. There. <laughs> no fishing for Randy. Uh, I got one. <laughs> I got a good one. <laughs> I did it. Ken Giru. That's the Orbital Factory. The Herbalist home. Fortune Teller's home. We've never been in here. Oh. Wait, hold on. Is that on is that on this map? It is not. Oh, but there's uh some stuff over there. Like, make sure we gotta we gotta make sure we go into all the buildings. Alright, who you be, Sigin? Once I've done the dishes, I'll get to training. Hey, so Emma was in the literature club at the military academy, right? Once I realized that, I figured maybe I could be more like her if I read books from the outside world. So I asked Euclase and got him to buy me a book on one of his trips. It's called Three and Nine. Have you ever heard of it? Can't say I have. This is the first time I've heard of it, too. Title's intriguing, though. In that case, I'd love, to, uh, I'd love to know what you think of it. Have at it, friends. At first, it reads like a regular story about a lady and her butler, but then the plot takes a huge turn. You won't be able to put it down, I promise. Thanks, I'll definitely dig in once I have some spare time. Dahlia. So you've decided to seek out the gnomes' headquarters. I want to say your actions are ill-advised, but seeing how hard you've been working, I'll trust your judgment. Your actions could be the key to unlocking the future you strive for, after all. Off with you, then. Return safely. Off you go, then. Okay. Where am I going? Not that way. I think we want to go to the general goods store. Looking away from you? Yeah. <laughs> At least she didn't turn her head all the way around. Dodged a bullet on that one. Okay. Well, things are just going to get weird with the, the fish. I wonder if this means that I can catch these fish. Can I buy bait? I can, and it's still super expensive. Why do you do this to me? Alright, so... Springs. Not again. TP was restored by 200. I feel like, oh, BP as well. And assault points. I feel like the developers of, of the game watched my playthrough and they're like, you know what? He's right. It doesn't make any sense to take showers or go into the uh, hot springs and only get 100 CP. So let's give him 200 like he suggested. I'm taking credit for it. Y'all can't stop me. That's it, right? The teleportation stone. Yeah, first things first. Let's head to the woods. Come on, we 
got a new costume for you. No, we didn't. Uh, travel hat. There's an interesting shine to the, like, her, I don't know, shoulder cloth? I, I don't know. Guessing it won't let me go over here, but I'm curious. The door is locked. When was Elias say this led to a clearing outside the village? Well, that's right. One that isn't usually in use, as I recall. I don't detect anyone there, though. Uh, though it doesn't seem the kind of place that warrants a visit either way. The wooden door is locked. The wooden door is locked. The wooden door. Pain should it should at least be worth it. We'll see. Well, here we are. We've come through here on the way to the labyrinth before, but the witches' tricks never cease to amaze me. The witches is, is, is. All right, that path leads to the labyrinth. The teleportation stone for Sutherland is on the right. Let's go. Ah, but you forgot to explain to me what's on the left. Because you forgot to explain to me what's on the left, we're going to be going in directions you never thought we would consider. Alright, there is nothing here. Let's uh, activate turbo mode a little bit and get back to where we were at. So it seems like we're going to be spending a lot of time in this witch village. Um, let's see, this doesn't look like the right teleportation zone. Agreed, Sutherland is in the opposite direction. I'm kind of curious to see where this one goes, but the Sutherland is more important right now. Um, I, I have a really, really bad feeling that this game is going to go in the direction of Cold Steel 2, like beat for beat. And let's just say, I hope it doesn't go that way. A teleportation stone. Could this be... Let's see if the pendulum activates it. Whoa. It just keeps on going and going. It seems there is a teleportation stone further up ahead that leads outside. Is it just me, or does this forest give off the weirdest vibes? That would be the higher elements at work. They were kept in check within the Saint Graal Labyrinth, unlike here. We'll just have to be extra cautious, as always, then. Gotta move real cautious. Yep, yep, yep. Yep. The... Yep. Vanish is, uh, such bullcrap. Get in there! Get in! Got him! Don't let up! I didn't even see that enemy. It was like invisible. Like invisible. Who? Focus like, who are we right now? All right! Now! Okay. Well, you don't have analyze. Why didn't I give you analyze? 
I, I know you have detector, but why didn't I give you that? Search mode activate. Hey, Angel. Scan complete. Not today. Oh, you are dead. Very well. Before I can even battle scope you. I shall go. Search mode activated. I think I just need to give her analyze. Scan complete. This will work for now. Got it. Ha! It's my turn. Ha, ha! Nice, we did it. Like three and a half years. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I started streaming November 6th, I believe. Someone, uh, <laughs> someone could, well, I guess you, yeah, someone could look below the stream, scroll down, and uh, give me the exact date on that, but I think it was November 6th. <laughs> They're in disarray. Ha, ha. Let's get them. Music is it's super mine. quiet right now. Here I, I go. Mean, anyways. Ha! My turn. Ooh. Go ahead and uh Let's go! Evan press! Activate that. Let's go! Yeah! I shall go. Uh... Oh, I didn't even notice that guy back there. Search These guys are activate. so invisible. How have I been? Long time no see? Scan complete. I've been doing I. You know, the the world is undergoing madness right now, so uh, doing the best you can with said madness. But I'm glad I'm able to at least stream for the time being. Especially since I'm playing this monster of a game. Now. Wow. Dying to reflect. Why isn't that a bonus thing? That needs to be a bonus thing. Here I go! It says November 2016. Also fall age as four years next month. Next month is November. <laughs> Set gunner. Next month is November. Ha! Got it. Ha! Oh. God. Very well. Ha! Um, <laughs> yeah. I, I guess I guess uh, four years is coming up now uh, somewhat quickly here strike wind blade formation now here I go set striker cha, cha. Uh, I originally here I go. Yeah. Kind of outlining all the go. the things that there. I gotcha. was doing when I first started streaming. I started off with Good the stuff, five Altini. year plan. You did it. I have your support to thank for that, instructor. Everything I have set up is basically on the five year plan. All of my analytics, all of my uh. Loading. Um, like the the stats that I'm tracking, like basically everything is on the five year plan, and I think that's uh, very curious. That's that's coming up. You're fine. Uh, we've still got to deal with these. It's what you might call a pain in the neck in more ways than one. Man. This place is a bit more twisty and turny than I was expecting. Let's take care that we don't get lost. I just wanted a treasure chest. I didn't want... 
to explore my progression. Eat this! We strike! Silver Search print. mode activate. Detailed information obtained. Rips through any intruder who dares cross its sacred land. Level 50? Wait, turn. are we level 50 now? Very well. Strike! Here I go! Ha! Oh, we're gonna get crit, but... Oh! Yeah, right! Now! Very well. Is that all? What will I do after the five years? Do I just set everything up for another five years? <laughs> okay, am I... Am I going the right way? Or am I going the wrong way? I want to go the wrong way. Alright, this is the right way. Oh. Treasure chest. Treasure chest. Right Old Blur R. See if I can get a triple link encounter here. Eat this! I'll show no mercy. Uh, that's a two chain. Two chain. My turn. Y'all should Arcus like activate. come up. My turn. This. Try this on for size. Crimson Gale. Ooh. Ah! Right, come into the circle. It's my turn. Ha, ha! I'm gonna move you back a little bit. Yeah. We're at 3.93 years. You pulled out of the calculator. My turn. Well, I applaud you on that, cause ha! not even I. It's down. Could have made that calculation They're in the calculator. Mine. Not today. Oh, I forgot to check our level. Now. Charging. Huh. I'm guessing we're level fifty. There's more. Sylvan Banshee. <laughs> uh, that reminds me of uh, uh, Legend of Zelda: Wind Waker. I uh, I actually had the urge to play that. Very well. A couple of days ago. There. An opening. Hit body. My turn. Arcus, activate. Oh. An opening. Glutton for punishment. My turn. What am I gonna do about this? You're done for. Eat this. Randy seems uh, pretty good. Eat this! Got him! Don't That's not up. what I wanted to do. But we're here now. Charging! Yeah. There! They're mine! I'll end it! Still haven't checked if I'm here I 50, go. by the way. Ha! 
soon to you. It's my turn! Set Gunner! There! God. <laughs> Big damage. Ugh. Yeah! I shall go. Let's go! Huh. There! They're mine! Here I go! Hmm. Yeah, Dante, you've been around for All a right. hot minute as well. Huh. <laughs> well, look at that! Alright, I wanted to check the levels. Yeah, so we are level uh, in the 50s. My turn. Now. Got it. Here I go. Very well. I don't think I like this uh, this new new getup that he's he's rocking here. Like the holster. What are you holstering there? A pouch? Come on, dog. One of those things where it's like, you know what? He's just a little <laughs> too symmetrical. You know what he needs? A pouch wrapped around his leg. Yeah. Victory is assured. Huh. All right, I'm just looking for huh. Victory is assured. I haven't been Apparently, I have been everywhere. I thought I saw some areas that I couldn't just go, or, well, that just weren't revealed yet. But apparently, I just wasted everybody's time. Let's activate turbo mode and get up here quickly. Make up for lost time. Morning, you were trimming up your facial hair because gotta be flying, whatnot, and found a gray hair. Bruh. Where is it? Right here? Right here? Tons of gray hairs right there, man. I am old. Uh, there it is. The teleportation stone Roselia told us about. Uh, we can use it to get outside, right? Nearly three weeks have passed since the great twilight began. I wonder how much has changed. No telling what lies ahead. Don't let your guard down. Feeling it this morning? We all feel the age creeping up on us. I don't mind the gray hairs. I mean, doesn't bother me. Usually don't run on Wednesdays, but you're gonna on your lunch break. Okay, okay. I have a bike that I bought for like $500 and uh, I rode it to work for a week and a half and then I never set foot on that bike again. Uh, where are we? Are we on the Sutherland side? All I can tell is that we're in a cave. You feel that? It's wind coming from over there. The exit must be that way, then. Let's go. Are we actually in a cave? Okay, because I was like, I don't see a ceiling, and there's a lot of light in here. Oh, we're here. Ist mir Great Forest. Oh, is that a yellow one? Man, that sure is one heck of a trick. Looks like we popped, uh, popped right out into the woodlands near St. Ark. 
I take it you guys are familiar with the place. Yeah, I never would have guessed we'd end up here, though. There are so many urn flowers here. This is the spot we visited during our special ops missions, isn't it? Special ops. Talk about rainbow ops. Oh yeah, during our first field exercises, we got ourselves into a pretty rough spot now that I think about it. That was four months ago now. Yet it feels like an eternity has passed since then. Leave the sentimental stories for later. We're not here to revisit memories. There's work to be done. Yes, of course. Our tasks are to investigate the singularity and assess the overall situation in the area. We will need to use our time effectively. First things first, we need to get uh, out of this forest. Be on guard and watch out for monsters. I would uh, try to... Okay. Oh look, there's an Orbment charging station over there. Yes, the special type that we've seen countless times before. <laughs> Thanks, video game. You popping off or just popping? You know what I've decided? I think everybody needs an analyze. That's what I've decided. Ooh, impede is so good. So good. I didn't do that. A little action one going on. Probably uh, upgrade a slot for somebody. Oh, no. I can upgrade that one. Oh my gosh. I wish they would fix this too. Okay, so you material's not like crazy expensive for all the quartz, it's just all the other stuff. Oh, it only requires two. Fascinating. Looks like they might have nerfed break, but I don't think so. I th think it was always that. It might have been this might have started at 40%, but I don't remember. Strength plus 80. Uh, evade is still in its nerfed form. Oh, move gives speed and movement. That's actually not too bad. Not too bad. Alright, impede is 90%. I think it was 100% in Cold Steel 3 and prior ones, and then there was the upgraded version, like the best version, that was 90%. <clears throat> we'll, we'll do that. Not gonna equip one on Randy anyways. Plot twist. Oh. Plot twist. Wait. Why can't I equip Silver Thorn right there? Oh, that... wait. Okay, so remove you. You there. And then... You there. 
There we go. Let's give you this. Let's give you that as well. I thought about giving it to him, but I think this will work out here. Uh, let's save. Uh, you were in a conference with your boss this morning and he changed some deadlines on you and wanted to know what you thought about the new deadlines. I told him he was being a real sucker right now. <laughs> oh. I'm glad I'm wearing off on you this thing. Makes me feel good about myself. Uh, actually, this is hour three, which means I'm going to mark right here. I know, it's going to be a little awkward. 